Hey everybody, it's Eric from epautos.com, your libertarian car guy, and you're probably wondering why I'm taking a video of the door to my garage. reason for that is I'm going to attempt to show you something about the 2019 Subaru Forester, and I've been having trouble taking video of it. The system hasn't been cooperative, or at least it, its timing hasn't been in conjunction with my video rig. The thing I want to show you, and I'm going to describe it before I go out there and try and show it to you, is a new facial recognition system that the 2019 Subaru Forester now offers. Um, it's designed to detect if you're taking your eyes off the road and then it, it launches a little warning uh, visual cue in the dashboard along with a little beep. And it's interesting and it's creepy at the same time. The system can actually keep track of eye movements and even I think head movements. I was experimenting with it and if I rotated my head to the left, uh, like I'm looking off to the left side of the road, the warning would come on. If I look down, it would do the same thing. It's not foolproof, but it really does a pretty impressive job of watching you if you're not watching the road. Um, I won't go off on too much of an editorial rant about what I think about that technology at this moment. I might do, do another video along those lines. But what I'm going to do now is walk out to the car and open the door and sit inside. And when you do that, the system uh, keys on and it scans your face. And hopefully you will be able to see the display, which is mounted in the top of the center stack, uh, actually tell you that. It'll say scanning. And as it does that, or once it does that, it will actually remember you. Um, and it can remember multiple drivers, I think. Uh, and then when each driver uh, goes back into the driver's seat, it recognizes that driver's profile. and. Uh, does its thing. So let's uh, let's go out there and see if I can show it to you. So bear with me. It's a miserable, cold, sleety, rainy day here. So hang on. Here we go. Oh, I see why people moved to Hawaii. All right, ready? I'm going to open the door and let's see what it does. Okay, sit down. Will it do it? Yes. Okay, see that? Driver monitoring system. So scan and process, I'm going to try to keep the video camera away from it so it can see me. Scan and process, scan and process. So it's checking me out. And I'm going to turn the thing on. And it's still processing me. Okay. Well, user recognition stopped. I think it may not have worked because I'm pointing the camera at it, and uh, or the video camera, and the video camera is getting in the way of its line of sight. The camera part of it, I think, is built in up here somewhere. But at any rate, you get the gist of it. So what happens if I turn my head to the left while I'm driving, a display will pop up here that says, uh, keep your eyes on the road or something to that effect. I forget the exact language. Um, so the car knows <laughs> it's watching you as you drive. Okay, I promised I wouldn't go off on a rant about that, but I'm gonna do it anyway. Um, I understand that a lot of people really like this technology, uh, and I agree that it's technologically incredibly impressive that they can do things like that, but my God, I'm creeped out by the prospect of my car watching me as I drive. It's like having my mother-in-law in the car. Um, you can turn it off. Um, that's the good thing about a lot of these safety features. You can turn them off. And I don't think it's standard. I think um, the one they sent me, uh, the, the model that they sent me is the Touring model, which is the top of the line Forester and has pretty much everything that they offer. Um, I think the lower trims of the Forester don't necessarily have this or you, you have the choice to, to get it optionally if you want. Anyway, uh, maybe I'm just being a slight paranoiac, and maybe I'm, I don't know, maybe I'm, I'm, I'm just off base. I don't know. You tell me. I'll have my review up at epautos.com. Let me know what you think. And thanks for viewing, and we will catch up again with you soon, and hopefully when it is warmer.